Collins, I be Man, I can't believe I got fired from Fairfield Inn. Now I will work at Cold Stone Creamery. Welcome to Cold Stone Creamery. How can I help you? Wait a minute. Weren't you the same guy that worked at Fairfield Inn a couple of days ago? Not at all. That was someone else that you saw at that other place that you were talking about. Are you going to order yourself some ice cream from here? Nope. I will just go to another Cold Stone Creamery that's in my city. Or I will be going to a Baskin Robbins instead. I have no problem getting myself ice cream elsewhere. I'm not going to be putting up with you today. Welcome to Cold Stone Creamery. How can I help you? I would like to get the Berry Berry Blue Ice Cream Combo, please. I'm sorry, but we aren't accepting signature creations at this Cold Stone Creamery Ice Cream Parlor. So you're going to have to order ice cream regularly. All right. I will just take just an regular ice cream with Butterfinger and Oreos in it. All right. Go ahead and have a seat. And we will be having your ice cream ready shortly. I guess. I will be waging at my table for my ice cream to be ready since you're not having the signature creations at this cold stone while other cold stones has the signature creations at their cold stone stores but it's whatever. But if something like this happens again, we're going to have a problem. Not even joking. Welcome to Cold Stone Creamery. How can I help you? Wait a minute. Weren't you the same guy that I saw at a Volkswagen dealership a month ago? Because you were extremely rude to them there. And weren't you also the same guy that was also rude to my boyfriend at your very last job at a Fairfield Inn Hotel not too long ago? First off, I was not rude to your boyfriend at one of my last jobs. Because he never showed up at my last job. Second, I don't remember seeing you at a Volkswagen dealership that I used to work at back in June. You just like to lie to me a lot of times. I will just go to another Cold Stone Creamery instead or I will be going to a Baskin Robbins if there's even one in my city. I'm not going to be putting up with your attitude today. Welcome to Cold Stone Creamery. How can I help you? Wait a minute. Didn't I remember seeing you at one of your jobs last week? Not at all. That was someone else that you saw. I don't remember seeing you at one of my jobs. Oh really? So why did I see you at a Rite Aid pharmacy a week or two ago? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't remember seeing you at that place. You just don't want to be truthful to me. I will just go to another Cold Stone Creamery. I'm going to be telling your boss on you for lying to my crush. Stay here and don't move. Horace, you are fired for being rude to the customers and for lying to my friend's crush and to several of my other friends. You are also banned from this ice cream parlor forever. Now go home right now before I call the cops on you. Fine. I don't like cold stone creamery anyways. Hey guys. Before I end this video. Sorry if I didn't work on this video earlier. I would say the first reason. But since that reason is very personal, I will not be giving that out but I will tell you is that I said something controversial about one of my friends last Saturday during a confrontation and I almost got in trouble for it. But I'm not going to talk about it due to what happened back in October. But me and my friend talked it out. So there's nothing really to worry about that now. And just recently. My city was completely covered with smoke due to the wildfires going on in my state which one of them grew into a very large wildfire completely east of my area. I will not be giving out the name of the city and the state I live in for privacy reasons. But I will tell you that I had to encounter the same situation four years ago back in 2018 and my school had to be closed for one day back then because of all of the smoke that completely covered up the sky in my area from a very large wildfire in my state. It doesn't matter for me anyways because I completely finished school over a month ago. But outdoor activities in my state had to be completely limited this year because of that. But if you want any more information about this, tune in to the news for more information. But for now, I will get everyone's birthday videos done. I hope you guys understand. But don't worry. Boris for Hire 202 will be out this weekend. 
There will also be a very special episode of The Spies of the Decives coming out Friday morning as well. There will also be a video coming out next week explaining the reason why I will not be posting as much. So stay tuned for that. But anyways. This is me Elias D signing off. Thank <music> you.